Hey there, my name is Todd Conaway, and I have another story for you, I think. So uh, I'm in a learning community, and uh, I've been a part of this little learning community here at a university for about five years, and there's never been more than about eight of us. Uh, several of us have just kind of been with this community for the whole five years, and uh, it's about teaching and learning on the open web. So good topic for openness. Uh, we've read books, we've read articles, we've looked at all the great people out there doing amazing work and wished we could be like them. And some days we make steps in that direction. This year, uh, we decided we would have uh, a guest speaker each month to come and visit our little uh, band. and. Uh, I invited some of the people I know to be a part of our little uh, monthly meetings. And I just know that it, the people that have shown up uh, have inspired the faculty that I work with uh, in a really positive way. They've seen amazing things being done out there and heard from the people doing them in a very small, uh, intimate, uh, if you can call Zoom intimate, a very small, intimate setting. And um, it's just been wonderful. Uh, and I feel so fortunate to know people who will willingly share those stories with uh, the faculty I work with. It's, it's so needed in today's uh, faculty development. Um, you know, I, I, I try hard to do some of these things, but uh, hearing these amazing stories from people so amazing is super valuable uh, to me. And I wouldn't have known all these people had it not been for like uh, the open web, right? Uh, Twitter land or posts by people putting stuff out there in the open. So I just feel super grateful. Uh, and to people like Alan who put these sorts of things together to make sure that I remember how fortunate I am and how lucky I am to, to be able to know people and, and to remind myself again that this is, this is what's possible. Um, and that's my amazing story of openness.